Well, good morning, Southlake family and friends. Happy and blessed Monday. So as we begin a new week in the Word, in our devotions, Psalm 84, 5 is the verse that's on my heart for us. And it says this, Blessed, uh, happy, is the man, the woman, whose strength is in you, whose heart is set on pilgrimage. So this idea of our hearts being set on on pilgrimage. What is that talking about? Well, in the Old Testament, we know the Jews several times a year, particularly for the three great festivals, Passover, Tabernacles, and Pentecost, would come from all over the nation of Israel, gathering together um, as they would ascend to Jerusalem, and particularly coming into uh, temple, the temple area, and to offer worship to God. It was the height of the center of their spiritual experience. And so the psalmist is referring here, though, to something that I know Jesus really took and internalized, that coming to the presence of God for worship, as it were, to the temple. But in the New Testament, Jesus took everything that was external and made it internal. And so we see this psalm, for instance, in God's word translation, it says, blessed are those who find strength in you. Their hearts on the ro- are on the road that leads to you. Um, another translation says it, I think, maybe best of all, those who put their strength in you are truly happy. Pilgrimage is in their hearts. And I love that idea, and I think that is the truth that the Lord would speak to us this week, is that uh, to be reminded and renewed and refreshed in this truth that um, our hearts, as they're set on the presence of God, walking in and living in the presence of God daily, filled with the Spirit of God, that peoples whose hearts are set, were devoted, were focused on walking with the Lord closely and intimately this day, this week, that that's where our happiness is going to be found. Blessed is the person. Blessed, insanely happy is that word, the, the makarios, the Greek word in the New Testament, but the same idea that's here in Psalms. So that's my prayer for you uh, and for me this week, Southlake family, and I pray you'll be able to receive that as God's blessing on your life. So let me pray. Lord, we commit to uh, today our way to you. We ask you, Lord, to fill us with your spirit. Lord, help us to have this sense of pilgrimage throughout this week, but the We're not going somewhere in the distance um, as pilgrims um, to find you, but the Lord, you're in our hearts and we have this relationship with you internally. Fill us with your spirit. Fill us with the sense of your presence and may you fill us in that process with joy. This week we pray in Jesus' name. Say amen with me, will you? Well, amen and amen. Well, God bless. Make make sure you uh, remember today that you're loved and I'll be praying for you. Look forward to talking to you again in the morning. God bless.